the beautiful people around the world. I'm so happy to see you back here. We're talking all things optimal health and nutrition. Have you heard about intermittent fasting? I feel like wherever I look and whoever I talk to, intermittent fasting is everywhere. Well, um, intermittent fasting is actually a concept that, that has been around for millennia. You might know some religions that use some sort of fasting. And intermittent fasting is a variation on the theme. So what we think about intermittent fasting these days is that in a 24 hour cycle of a day, you would fast, so not eat, not drink any sugary drinks for an extended period of time. And people usually do that overnight. So while you're sleeping, you're not eating anyway, so that makes it easier. And then they extend it out in the morning or you know start not stop eating rather in the evening so that instead of not eating for eight ten hours you extend it out to 12 14 15 16 etc hours and there are some proposed health benefits to that and some of them for example are to give your system an opportunity to rest to detox um, to lose weight lots of people actually do it to lo lose weight to increase your clarity in your mental function and also to help your digestive track track and yeah those are some of the some of the benefits that uh, have been known to occur through intermittent fasting Lots of people, I think, these days use it to lose weight. And that's not a problem in and of itself. The challenge that I see with intermittent fasting is that many people come to intermittent fasting without enough information about it, without really planning it, and without knowing whether it's for them. Well, if you feel drawn to it, you might try it out. However, some people benefit from it and some people, for them, it can actually be detrimental. So to start off with, you need to know whether it's good for you, whether it's right for you. If you have challenges with eating disorders, intermittent fasting will be most likely detrimental to you. So be careful to just jump on it because it sounds great and everyone talks about it and everyone talks about the benefits. Always consider whether it's really right for you and your situation. No matter what your motivation is, you also want to know how you want to do it. You can ease yourself into intermittent fasting and start slowly. Start with a, you know, perhaps 12 hour, 10 hour, don't stress about the length of fasting. Just start slowly and ease yourself into it. Then the other challenge is what do you do while you're in intermittent fasting? One trap, for example, and I can tell that from my own experience, is that when you start with intermittent fasting, that is the trap that once that time window of fasting is over, you can run to the fridge or to your kitchen cupboard and get all the food, food you're craving out and eat as much as you can in that hour, win, in that you know window of time where you can eat. That's not ideal. And that's of course not the ideal of intermittent fasting. So have a plan of the foods that you enjoy in that time period while you can eat. And also have a plan for the length of time, like how many weeks, months, days, are you doing the intermittent fasting? Some people do it a few days a week. Some people do it for a certain period of time. And what do you want to achieve with that? So yeah, what, what do you want to achieve with it? Do you want to have mental clarity? Do you want to have an opportunity to reset? Do you already feel like you have a balanced diet, lifestyle, etc.? So you just want to use this as an opportunity to yeah, reset your, your system or do you want to lose weight what do you do when you stop intermittent fasting what's your plan so these are my thoughts on intermittent fasting 
pretty simple, pretty clear, and I hope they're helpful for you. If they are helpful, if you have any thoughts on it, if you have any questions, please leave them below the video. And also please know that I'm on all social media pages such as Instagram and Facebook. So shoot me a message um, if you have any questions or any comments. I would love to hear from you. And you can also find me on my new website, trifactorholisticnutrition.com. The link to this website will be posted below in the comments section. So please check it out if you would love to seek help and advice, support and guidance on your journey to your best health, please contact me. I would love to hear from you. Check out my website and I would love to leave you with this and wish you wonderful, good health.